Dozens of South Georgians and law enforcement officers locked arms to show support during a prayer vigil in Moultrie tonight. WALB News 10's Raisa Buckles attended the ceremony and she is live in the newsroom with a story. Jim, tonight's ceremony was very emotional to say the least. The church house was packed from wall to wall with community members and local officers all united under one front to break every chain. Moultrie Police and Colquitt County officers and community members showed their unity by locking arms during tonight's prayer vigil at Friendship Missionary Baptist Church. Two weeks ago, the church decided to host the service. In every quarter, the church leads prayer vigils, but this one focused on law enforcement. We want to bring unity, love, peace, justice, healing, and at the end, we will have solidarity. Alma Fleming is one of four organizers. Fleming didn't hesitate with leading the service after the pastor approached her with the idea. Excitement. I'm always excited when I feel that I'm being a helping force, a source, in doing things to bring a betterment to our community. Fleming also serves on the Concerned Citizens Advisory Committee for Moultrie Police Department. God died for us all, so why should we take each other's lives? So, it hurt. Officers and residents and even the local pastor were moved. <laughs> Law enforcement were grateful. We're honored. Um, it's nice to know that there's people in the community that do care. Stephen says officers are on high alert. Once you get to know them, you'll feel more comfortable with them and when you see them frequently in your area you'll say oh that's officer you know blah 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 officer brown officer whomever you will know them fleming hopes that residents left feeling closer to local officers and continue to be their eyes and ears when something is going on in the community live in the newsroom Risa buckles walb news 10.